Do you suffer with bad breath or lack of confidence when you're on a date? Or have you ever had an old crown replaced or an implant adjusted and you get this really bad taste? Maybe even you just get lots of staining underneath your veneers. One of the most common problems or reasons for this is nitrate producing bacteria. And when you have more of these bacteria that produce nitrates, you're more likely to have an unhealthy mouth. So by lowering these, you can increase the health and you can lower the amount of cavities, gum disease, uh, halitosis, which is the clinical name for bad breath, and even reduce blood pressure and other diseases. One of the most common reasons for this is a bad diet. So when you get to your healthy vegetables like leafy greens, beets, your dark antioxidant fruits, those help create nitrate reducing bacteria in your mouth, which can make your mouth much healthier. So this is often when we see people who have had veneers or implants or Invisalign and they feel like they still get cavities or still get irritated gums or still have bad breath. A lot of times it comes down to diet. Like so many things these days, the health of our diet and what we consume matters as much or sometimes more than the maintenance we do at home. So. Sometimes you may meet someone who they don't brush as regularly as they should, and maybe they don't floss as regularly as they should, or they don't take as good of care of their implants or veneers, but they eat a healthy diet and they drink water and they build an environment for their mouth that's more conductive and conducive to healthy nitrate reducing bacteria. So another way to do this is by taking probiotics and these are dental probiotics. These help grow the good kind of bacteria in your mouth. It really comes down to being a battle between good versus bad bacteria. And when the good bacteria win, you'll have a healthier mouth, less chance for oral disease, less chance for systemic disease, and most importantly, less bad breath or less bad tastes. And if you're not, start incorporating some of these dark fruits and vegetables into your diet. I think you'll see a huge difference.